sweet. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. Um, today I'm heading down to Chicago. I'm currently in Mundelaine. Oh, actually, this is Libertyville, but I'm staying in Mundelaine at my cousin's. Um, but today I'm going to be going down to Chicago. I'm going to be taking the train from Libertyville all the way down to Union Station. So, super excited. Uh, the fare was like seven bucks. I get unlimited rides all day. Excited to go see the Chicago Fire play the New York City football club today. That's cool. There's a lot of people here already. Station. I'm here in the Great Hall. Check it out. It's pretty nice. Pretty grand. So it is currently 12:30. Game doesn't start till 5 p.m. So I'm gonna go grab some brunch. Probably like five, ten minute walk. So I've only been to Chicago one other time previously. That was about 2019 or 2020. It's like pre-COVID, I want to say, or no, it, I think it was the summer of COVID, 2020. I helped uh, one of my friends, Jerm, previously on a previous vlog. I helped him move from Delaware back to California, so I flew out there and just drove back with them. And yeah, we passed by here. This was one of our stops. It's pretty nice. Had deep dish. Check out Millennium Park, which I probably will be doing today. close now. Alright guys, I'm gonna be eating right there. I don't know how to pronunciate it. Oh, for a ball. Cool. Just finished having lunch over uh honestly don't know how to pronounce it. I think it's all Shaval, something like that. It's like an American upscale diner kind of thing. It was cool. So the bar top, got to see like the kitchen staff prepping, cooking, hustling. Yeah, it was nice. Uh, I got myself a single cheeseburger, but technically it comes it's a double. Yeah, interesting fact. So a single is a double cheeseburger, and a double is a triple cheeseburger. But yeah, I had myself one of those with bacon and a paloma. Both were stupendous. Because honestly, it's been a while since I've had a really good cheeseburger like that. And wow, that was really definitely up there. Um, shout out to Jordan. He uh, attended to me. Shout out my YouTube channel. He says he was going to subscribe later on. So thank you for that. Thank you for comping my burger. It's all good, man. I am gonna try and hit the Art Institute, but I don't know if I have enough time. And then afterwards, I might just walk around Millennium Park. Mm -hmm. 
Look at these people. Sick. That's so fucking cool. Definitely wouldn't go on that, guys. Look at this. Oh, I'm in Chicago, boy. Let's go. This is crazy. This place is really nice, honestly. I, In a heartbeat, I would move here, guys. I'm so sorry. I know. But wow. I mean, it's just... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is sick. This is so cool. What? Wow. Incredible. Cool. Just got to the entrance of Millennium Park. Sick. People lining up or what? Well, last time this place was gated, guys. able to get this close last time y'all Cool guys, just left the museum, Art Institute of Chicago. Hell yeah, now that's a museum. That was great. Admission was only 25. Got to see the self portrait of Van Gogh. They had a little bit of everything actually. They had the Tokyo collection, just, just like a little collection of art pieces based about Tokyo. Super nice, dude. Super nice museum. And now I'm heading over to, well, I'm going to go try and get an Uber. See how much that cost me. Not exciting. But yeah, I'm going to catch an Uber and make my way over there. Let's see how it goes. Well, I'm going to take the train, guys. I'm taking the train and then catching an Uber at that train stop. Hopefully I make it in time.
just got off the train from Pulaski. Gonna catch an Uber out here. It's 434. I think it's like a 15 20 minute drive from here. Hopefully, I make it in time. I think I should. Game's supposed to start at 5. Alright, quick update, guys. Oh, shit. Nice. I. Uh, Uber dropped me off a little bit before, felt bad, making him sit in traffic, and also I think this is a faster route. This is ridiculous, man. Oh, so far getting to the stadium has not been it. Yes, I know, kind of press my luck with time, but even so, someone should be directing traffic. And yeah. Here we go. I can see the top of the place, I think game probably already started. It's 507 guys. What a mission. Should I do the same thing this guy did? I think I am gonna do that. Ugh. Smart. So yep. Game has begun already. Massive line of cars behind me guys. Oh. No no no. Uh, LA Galaxy all over again or LAFC man I wish the the L train came all the way out here or E train but look at this it looks alright looks interesting man it could have been a soldier field though what a mission to get to this stadium guys here's the game going on Yes, here we are. Welcome to the Sea Geek Stadium. Let's go. Wow. Very impressive, Steve. Alright, guys, it's a lot of us running late. Oh, I'm exhausted.
Dan didn't cross. guys the bands, Chicago Zero New York City football club two. just left the stadium behind me the seat geek stadium it was fun a little out of reach from Chicago but it was cool it was pretty small I think it holds up to 28,000 people so, definitely not no soldier feel, <laughs> I imagine. Game ended in 2-0 in favor of the visiting team, New York City. <clears throat> yes, so, two goals I think in the first half actually. What was it, one in each? I can't remember. But yeah, um, Chicago honestly looked pretty bad out there. Um, I mean, I'm glad it was only 2-0, not anymore. Cause they didn't do much. Yeah. But yeah, so that wraps it up for this weekend over here in the Midwest. Next few stops is gonna be Charlotte and Atlanta. So that those should be fun as well. And my friend Fernando's gonna be joining me on that one. So that's going to be next weekend. Yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Thanks for watching.